My name is Chris Rennick. I'm the Engineering Educational Developer in the Engineering Ideas Clinic here at the University of Waterloo. The University of Waterloo is in Waterloo, Ontario, Canada. Uh, we are Canada's largest engineering school with over 8,000 engineering undergraduates in 14 programs. Uh, and campus-wide, we have 40,000 students. The Engineering Ideas Clinic brings the real world into the classroom. In this space, students work with their peers to solve big, complex engineering problems. Because of the pandemic, this space isn't that busy right now. Normally, we'd have over 200 students working together on discipline-specific problems um, that really relate their engineering content to the real world. The Brock Solutions Industrial Automation Hub takes this a step further. Uh, we have partnered with Brock Solutions, Opto22, and Inductive Automation to create a real uh, engineering problem that relates to the industrial automation domain, where students can get hands-on with this real-world equipment and real-world tools uh, from that domain. This project is relying on Brock Solutions' uh, expertise in moving uh, baggage around airports. So we're trying to kind of capture a feeling of that problem in a setting that can work in the classroom. When students take part in this activity, they're going to be using programmable logic controllers, inductive automation software platform called Ignition to implement a package handling system. I'm David McDougall, business unit leader at Brock Solutions. Brock Solutions is a global systems integrator focused on real-time operational solutions for clients across many different industries. We assembled a team of innovative leaders from across our business to bring real industry problems to the table for the students to solve. Uh, so we've had over 400 students take part in this activity so far. I'm Rapti Ghosh. I'm a third-year mechanical engineering student at the University of Waterloo, and I'm currently employed as a co-op student at the Engineering Ideas Clinic. I love uh, working at the Ideas Clinic. It's given me some amazing exposure to real world industries, as well as an amazing network of peers and colleagues, uh, professors, staff, um, as well as professional engineers in the industry as well that I've um, um, had the opportunity to meet. My name is Eugene Lee, and I'm an instructor at the University of Waterloo. This project uses DC motors, a camera to train the neural network, and a power diverter. This project helps the instructors by giving the students a physical experience that they can relate back to. When we're talking about concepts in class, they can think back to what they've done in the lab and bring everything together. I've been able to not only work within my domain of mechanical engineering, but br branch out to different uh, engineering disciplines and really see how everything comes together to build a project such as this one. I'm Kevin Lee, I'm a second year student at, in computer engineering at the University of Waterloo and I'm employed at the Engineering Ideas Clinic. It has always been my dream to go to this university since I live in this area and it's the best engineering school in Canada. It's really exciting to learn all these concepts through my coursework and be able to directly apply them here at the Ideas Clinic. I believe that this is very useful for deciding my future as well as building my skill set towards that future. This project has provided me with some amazing design challenges that I've really enjoyed um, working and learning from and um, it's really pushed me to the next level in terms of my own engineering skills and capabilities. Inductive Automation's University Engagement Program has been a great bridge for us uh, to connect industry to students in the classroom. We definitely have a plan to expand this project to other uh, parts of our programs and potentially other things in the future. We are at the beginning of the journey with the University of Waterloo. It's really exciting to see the innovative solutions that the students are bringing to this project. I really thank um, Inductive Automation, Brock Solutions and Opto22 as they've been really instrumental in helping this project um, get going and I've really appreciated their insight and I'm just really enjoying myself uh, working on this project.